Okay, so let's go do that. Now that we've finished both of these. Sweet. All right, so the merchant was back uh, over here. So let's place a waypoint. We're all the way. Oh, we're pretty close to it, actually. Okay. Let's head on to him. Okay, we can't jump down there. That would not be a good idea. Drop to ledge. Okay, C is the command to get off of those things. Let's go make some monies. Stocking up. Alloy returns. A bunch of real life experience. Gaining levels, skills, combat experience. Okie dokie. Looks like he's having bad stomach pains or something. What's up, what man? What is it now? <laughs> so friendly. Let's trade. Okay, so the resources that... No, I can sell. So we figured out all these are for selling. Yeah, you know, and it tells us the same things here. That's great. Okay. I guess I could have seen that before. Let's go ahead and... Sell. Droop. Okay. And then we're going to sell multiple. I don't know if that saves any time. Nope. Okay, and that one, we're gonna go ahead and sell multiple. Cool, and these are good for selling. Just one of those, so let's go ahead and sell it. Sell it. Oh, look at that, we're rich now. Compared to when we first saw this guy. Okay, we're going to do the sell multiple. Boop. Okay. And sell and sell. Cool. Now the rest of this stuff is used for crafting things, right? Crafting, crafting, crafting. Okay, not this one. The fast travel pack provides fast travel to a single discovered campfire or settlement throughout the world. Oh, so you got to use your fast travel packs to travel. Okay, so we're gonna keep that. Okay, so you get a limited amount. Okay, so now we have 337 shards. What do we want to buy? We want to buy a better bow, right? Warbow. This low damage weapon fires elemental payloads best used to put targets into vulnerable states, providing a valuable combat advantage. Can be modified. Slow firing but highly accurate bow is best used for long range combat when target position is critical. Can be modified. Hmm. Elemental bombs. So I figure I want that, but I don't have any elemental payloads yet. I don't even know about those yet. Okay, we could buy these resources if we really needed them. Potions, ammo, treasure boxes. Hmm. We buy the free sample box. 
Okay, let's buy that. How much are these? Oh, Banuk. Okay, you gotta have a trader token to get those out of stock. So I don't see any any like um, armor or anything like that. I don't know if I want any of these weapons or not. Handling, what does it say the damage on it? Let me see, um, okay, we'll back out of here. I want to look at my current bow. Always a pleasure doing business. Are you worried I'm going to tell someone that you trade with outcasts? I don't think you're the kind who talks, but you never know. You can stop worrying. The secret's safe with me. Yeah, that's what I figured. But I don't mind hearing it. Why do you take the risk, trading with outcasts? Every time you ask. If a big, meaningful talk is what you're after, move along. It's because you used to be one, isn't it? Yeah. Got caught poking around one of the metal ruins out beyond the embrace. Matriarch said I was tainted and gave me five years. What did you see in the ruins? Nothing I can make sense of. After my shunning, I tried living back in Mother's heart, but everyone I knew had moved on, and there were so many people everywhere I turned. I like it better out here. Hmm. Let's just finish all these the dialogue only options. The ever told about our trades is Rost. Yeah, well, not like he can turn me in, even if he wanted to. Law and duty sort of a man, that Rost. I don't know how you stand it. You really don't know why he was cast out? I've told you no. I don't think anyone knows what he did, but it must have been serious because his term is for life. I suspect it was taken on her. Because they said it was by choice. But I guess who knows? that concludes our business. All right. That would be rough Good for her to learn if that was the case, though, wouldn't Blessing it? Of all mother and all that. Okay, so we're going to meet Rost at the North Gate. I wanted to look at my own weapon here. So... 15 damage with the regular ammo. 28... Shield thing. It's got the two modifications. Yeah, it shows what damage it does with each of the kinds of ammo. The fire arrow actually does less damage, but it um, does 25, I guess, dots over time. I think that's how that reads. So it would do 37 damage overall, if that's true. Um, the regular ammo does have a chance of, uh, I guess, doing 28 damage to armor. Is that what that means? I think so. So that warbow was not necessarily the thing, huh? They only showed that one kind of ammo, the payload ammo. And we don't know about that yet, so we'll have to wait on that. We do have more modifications here. Tear, the fire, the shock, corruption, stealth. Okay. Let's go into crafting. There's nothing there for us yet. All right, let's move on. Well, I guess I could have made some arrows in that menu, but I'll do them here. Okay, let's go meet Rost, unless we get uh, distracted along the way. But it looks like we've gone around this area pretty well. We've done all the campfires, except the one that we're about to meet him at. We've checked all this out. 
Yeah, let's go. I don't know if we'll ever be able to come back to this area or not. But we'll find out. Let's go this way. Just in case there's something else to run into. In this direction. And let's just peek what's over this ridge. That should have filled... Should have uh, freed up some stuff in our in our resource bag. So this must be like out of bounds, right? Or not? There's actually stuff down there. This can't go from this side. thing no. to fight down there, a scrapper. Any warmer out here. Oh, we can't enter this location. Okay, yeah, so this may very well be all out of bounds. Unless we go down through there. Oh, okay, this is... No, this isn't Rost. Rost is way over there. This is another gate. This must be... The East Gate. Well, no, that's the North Gate. Main Embrace Gate. Okay. This dude doesn't want to talk to me. Let's go down here and just, out of curiosity... Let's see if we can go through that gate. Saving these for the trail. I thought I had more medicine than that. I need to go up over there. It's noisy out there. Yeah, it looks like that's the end of the road. They're hunting out there. It doesn't sound easy. It wants me to hold a mouse button. The stealth swim. Yeah, we can't go through there. Let's try the stealth swimming. <laughs> Is it that button? Oh, it's my dodge button. I can't see myself, but I'm under there. Okay. Stealthy even from ourselves. Okay, we got that campfire. Hey, You're here. You have the fire arrows. I do. Those explosions and shouts beyond the embrace. Is that the trouble you were talking about? You will know soon enough. Until then, we wait for dark. Wait for dark? I got Odd Grata her rabbits, for which she thanked All Mother, of course. It was All Mother working through you to bring her the rabbits. You always say that, but I was there and I hunted alone. And you always say that, and so <laughs> make yourself alone. I saw Karst and got that tripcaster I was talking about. I hate to think what that outlawed trader charged for a weapon of that make. It wasn't cheap, but the caster is worth it. Perhaps. You'll know it's worth soon enough. I don't understand. 
Those explosions are outside the embrace. What can we do from in here? The lesson will be taught in due time, Aloy. Till then, we wait. We gotta keep it extra mysterious. Look, Rost. I've thought it through, and I'm not going to shun you after the proving, okay? I'm just... I won't do it. I'm not about to pretend that you never raised me. Aloy, the law forbids all contact. It does, and I don't care. I know what duty means for you, Rost, but all tribal law has ever done for me is take things away. And that's not gonna happen again. Aloy, I must obey the law. Law and order kind of guy. I knew you'd say that, so this is what we'll do. I'll come to you in secret. No one will see me, so I won't get in trouble. A and I know you won't talk to me because it's against the law, but I'll talk to you. It'll be my crime, not yours. You'll just listen. And that's how we'll handle this. You've put a lot of thought into this. I he know. appreciates you, man. So you can stop worrying. It's handled. Yes. So it is. He took care of her. Still a while to go before dark. I guess I'll get some rest. Good idea. There'll be no time for sleep tonight. Alright, so there's some big nasty out there that we're gonna need to handle. We gotta rest at the campfire. Um, let's look real quick if we can make some more of this. Oh, we can. Nice. What do the numbers do? Oh, they go around. Okay. I don't know if that's any easier. Okay, so now we have four out of four of those, so we're good. Let's go ahead. Unless we made more, we could make a bigger pouch for it. Let's see. Crafting, capacity. There was the trip caster ammo pouch. We can do that. Let's go ahead and make that. Cool. Cool. And maybe we'll make that too. What do we have left? Traps pouch, outfits, and weapons. So we don't need those yet. But then for crafting, we can go down to ammo. We can make definitely another one of those. Now we're at six out of six. Cool, we're set on that. Okay, we should hopefully be ready for tomorrow. Thirty out of thirty, twenty-nine out of thirty. Okay. Let's save again. I guess that's how we rested. Opening a gate for an outcast? Some who are shunned reaped honor before disgrace. <sighs> so much for tribal law. I spoke to no <laughs> one, and now we must both keep silent, for we are outside of the embrace. These are the true Guess wilds, the law doesn't Aloy, include whistling. With threats unlike any you have ever faced. That carcass. What sort of beast was that? The tribe calls it a sawtooth, and it's something new, something angry. Since mm -hmm. they first started appearing ten years ago, they have killed many braves. Yeah. So we have to follow the path of destruction. It's got a bunch of stuff in it. Guess high risk, high reward, huh? Keep that for later. 
follow the path. It's not far. That cabin. What happened to it? A machine, that's what. What sort of machine does that? The sort of machine you're hunting now. Oh. I see. Okay. So we got the tripwire up. Let's keep it up for now. Let me do some of this action. There's something. Str okay, it's just a strider. I'll watch your carcass. I'll harvest the parts. Watch your surroundings. Not much in there. Dead guy. There's a watcher. Tag him. Oh, you gotta change weapons. Won't be much farther now. Stealth kill. Why are we the only ones out here tonight? Why can't the tribe's braves hunt this machine? They did. The kills we've passed are theirs. Tomorrow, they will hunt again. They won't need to. This machine will be my kill. Or your death, if you're not careful. It's amazing, as attached to me as he is, that he's willing to uh, risk my life. But I guess that's the way of the tribe, huh? things let's take the high ground guess we're here an entire lodge wrecked by sawtooths how many were there I didn't bring you here to answer questions, Aloy. I brought you here to deal with that. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. It's huge. How do you defeat it? That will be for you to decide. This trying to get me yours killed. To make Aloy, yours alone. No matter what happens, I will not intervene. Do you understand? I guess this is my you proving. I should stay out of sight. I can use the tall grass to approach. We've got a box here. Okay, let's see. Where can I place my traps? Okay, yeah, we're definitely gonna have to trap it. Use our trip caster. Well, can we scan it? Let's see, it's a. Uh... Weak points. It's got a canister. Underneath, it looks like. And let's use that thing where we uh, highlight its track. Then we'll know where it's going to go. It's doing this circle here. So let's uh, let's 
do this here, huh? This may take a minute. Okay, we've got that. Should we double it up? I don't know if that's a waste. And now we wait, right? Maybe we'll put another one here. Because we'll wait for it to come around. You'll get shocked there. We'll start shooting it. It'll wake up. It'll attack us again. It'll try to attack us. It'll come this way. And it'll get frozen again. Okay, there it comes. Let's switch to bow and arrow. Weakness is fire. Right. So this is also why we wanted to um, get the fire arrows. Got those. I want that. I don't know if we're going to be able to reach that. Come on through, buddy. Oh, this is, are we on the wrong side? This track is on the other side of that rock. Oh, crap. Alright, we misjudged that. Wasted a bunch of those. But we should be able to make more. These guys. So let's, uh... Make some more. Oh, crafting. Yeah, let's... No, not modify. Ammo. Okay. Yeah, that's all on the other side of that, so we misjudged that. Alright, well, we'll do it from here. Use this grass. Get our trip caster. Oh no, that's the wrong thing. Okay, we got a couple of those up. And now it's gonna get it. Let's switch back to this. Get that canister lit up. Come on, buddy. Whack it. Whack it, whack it, whack it. Almost got it. Was it down? It's down. We got it. No problem. Why did I bring you here? Not to answer questions. Aloy. Survival requires perfection. It was a test to hone my skills against a dangerous new machine. Follow. What about congratulations? 
I got it good. These are Nora hunting lands. They must be protected. If you hadn't destroyed the Sawtooth, how many braves might it have killed or injured tomorrow? The lesson lives within the question, Aloy. For years, you've trained to win the proving, but only for yourself. As a brave, it will be your duty to fight for your tribe. My tribe? You said I wouldn't need them. But I never said the tribe wouldn't need you. The strength to stand alone, Aloy, is the strength to make a stand. To serve a purpose greater than yourself. That is the lesson you must learn. And remember it. After the proving. And after I'm gone. You are the protagonist. We're finished here. Follow. What about my congratulations? <laughs> Dawn has passed. This will be your last day in the embrace as an outcast. Use the time to set your mind on the challenges before you. When it is time for you to go to Mother's Heart, I'll be waiting for you along the way. Okay. I understand the final lesson, Rost. Do you? But if I'm going to stand for something, it'll have to be something I believe in. Then I hope you find it, Aloy. I hope you do. I'll go back to the cabin with you. I'm not heading there just yet. I have other plans. Oh, such as? I'll be waiting for you when it is time. <laughs> she should know better than to ask that. I did too, but I thought I might I'll as well use the dialogue heart, options anyway. You will. Okay. Ping pong. I think Dusty was working on removing the um, extra deaths on there. The death counter is still one high right now. Let's go ahead and get this save. That's okay. We can just skip adding the next death. Daybreak. Yesterday's gone. So we're supposed to talk to Rost. All the way over here. That went remarkably well. With the sawtooth, but... It had me, like... So hyped up for it. I was being extra careful. But yeah, we figured some stuff out for it. Oh yeah, we can make, um... Another set of those now. We're full up on herbs. We can get more of this wood, though. Oh, we got... Critters here. Always critters here. I don't know if we need them. Hardy little plant. You'll help. Yeah, let's just move on, I'd say. So weird having the neon messages on top of the, like, the tribal script. But I guess that's the juxtaposition of this game. Alloy is all grown up. You notice how they're both named after metals? Rost is rust. And, uh, Alloy is alloy. Aloy is alloy. Mother's heart.
Yeah, up here. So Aloy. pretty. We must speak. So, it's time. Are you ready? I hope so. <laughs> yes, I guess. It's louder than I expected. You've never been so close before. I guess everything's bigger up close. Soon it'll all seem familiar. Like home. I don't know about that. Look for High Matriarch Tirsa. She'll help you. Any other concerns? Mm. Any final lessons before I head in? No. You've learned every lesson the Wilds have to teach. It was you who taught me, not the Wilds. Not sure my bow and spear will be much help in there, though. It is with bow and spear that you'll win what you've wanted all these years, Aloy. Answers. All right, let's hope so. What should I expect once I'm inside? There will be people celebrating and feasting. More than you've ever seen in one place. No other village compares to Mother's Heart. It is the seat of the High Matriarchs. A center of Nora life. A jewel of the sacred land. Give it time. And you'll grow fond of it. As I was. Back when I was at the tribe. Are you sure they're going to let me in? <laughs> I've told you, Aloy. By law, any child outcast can run in the Proving. And any who pass are made braves and are outcasts no more. I know that. But not everyone follows the law like you do, Rost. Have faith, Aloy. The tribe will honor your right. I'm ready to do this. See you back home in a few days? You will not find me there, Aloy. Here. Aww. It's complicated. Take this, too. Remember. Why are you talking like we'll never see each other again? No. No! You should be with the tribe. And I will always be an outcast. But I told you, I have that figured out. I'll come to you in secret. I'll be the one breaking the law, not Shouldn't you. Have told you don't even plan. have to talk to me. This attachment to me will only hold you back. It's my wish that you embrace the tribe. You've lived in isolation long enough. Not until now, I didn't. For your sake, I must go where you will never find me. This she shouldn't have told him her plan. This is goodbye. Oh, Rust. Hmm. We're gonna use our big brain again. No, it's not. You taught me how to track. Wherever you go, I can follow. Not this time. This time. And every time. I'll be wearing this when I find you. That's right. May all mother bless you. She loves you, man. For good... Good reason. And you. He's trying to be so dang selfless. I have to let him go. For now. I think he's already First, gone. The proving. After that, I'll see where his trail leads. Alrighty. Time to do this. Let's go. Nice drums. Nice village. You will turn back outcast. Or bleed. Your choice. And not honoring Make way. the code. Make way. Okay, she's coming. Braves, stand aside. She is welcome here. Mother's heart is open to you, child. Come. 
I assure you, most Nora aren't so rude as those idiots. You're Tirsa? <laughs> Who else would I be? Come on now. How I've does she know this day that she was out time. there? Must have been looking. You have? Oh, yes. But for the moment, I must leave you. I have other outsiders to keep safe tonight. You what? Envoys from another tribe, the Karja. Come to observe the proving, and oh, how the Nora hate the Karja. Karja? But that's my problem. We will talk later. In the meantime, enjoy the festival. Oh, down the path to the right, you'll find an old friend who can't wait to see you. But I don't know anyone here. <laughs> Try telling him that. We will talk later. May the goddess protect- That must have been the boy she saved. Okay. Down the path to the right. So we're actually in. This must be weird for her because she's never been with this many people. Can I go now? Okay. Big party. Guess we'll do a savey save. What's this? Oh, I can interact with the fire. Got a bunch of meat on there. Okay, that's fine. Aloy! It's you, isn't it? I was right. Over here. It is Aloy, isn't it? I'm remembering your name correctly? Are you the old friend Tirsa told me about? I don't know you. I see you don't recognize me. Well, it was a long time ago. Teb is my name. You were half my size when you saved me from a herd of machines. I remember. You tried to thank me. I never forgot that day. All these years, I hoped to see you again, if you came to run in the Proving. As you can see, I didn't turn out to be much of a hunter. I served the tribe as a stitcher instead. A maker of garments and armor. Oh, hook me up, dude. In preparation for this yes. day, I've made an outfit. Excellent. I hope you like it. What's it going to cost? Cost? <laughs> Nothing. Consider the thanks I tried to give years ago. Long overdue. All right. What do we get? We get choices. Nora Brave. A new Nora Braves armor stitched by Teb, accentuated by Alloy's own designs. Offers no extra protection, can but can be upgraded. Okay. These are different. These are money. I have 384 metal shards. This is the Silent Hunter Medium. This makes me stealthier. Okay, so this is good against temperature. All right, and then this is the one that he's going to give me. Okay, so let's take that. And we'll equip it. Yep. And then while we're in here... Should we buy this? Tempted to. Oh, we don't have watcher lenses to get this one. We could get this one. Yeah, let's do it, I think. Although then I won't have enough sparkers if I need to make more tripwires. Let's hold off on that. Let's hold off. Pretty sure. 
with all this. Alright, these are things I can just sell. Might as well do that. This is used for trading with merchants, selling for metal shards. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, sell that. That's a crafting thing. And this, the sawtooth one. I don't know if the merchants give me different prices or whatever, but he should give me good prices, right? Because he likes me. So let's do that. We got 476 shards now. Now we got two outfits. So we definitely got to modify that one. Yeah. Seems to fit you perfectly. Uh, thank you, Tep. I've never had anything like this before. Well, it's yours. I think you'll find it affords more protection than what you were wearing. I said it Every offers no protection, offers but it advantage. is modifiable. It's always a trade-off. Anyway, I shouldn't keep you any longer. Head for the Matriarch's Lodge if you want to find Tirsa. You'll know it when you see it. A large wooden building with an angry mob waiting outside. Tirsa said <laughs> something about envoys from another tribe? Yes, that's what the mob's angry about. Karja visiting our sacred land for the first time in years. I'd expect to see some tomatoes fly, maybe rocks. Hopefully not spears. In any case, be ready to duck. She stopped drinking. Okay, how everybody has a little design painted on them. Alright, let's uh look at our outfits. So I guess the only thing different about this is that it can be upgraded, right? So let's go to crafting, modify outfits. And we got an empty slot. What can we put in it? Resist ranged attacks, resist freeze, resist shock, or more stealth. I guess ranged attacks. Yeah, I'm not sure. Let's take that. Okay. So she's got that. Not a ton of protection. Beer for everyone! Beer for everyone! Alright, well, she he made it for us, so we'll wear this. I wouldn't mind some actual armor protection. I don't think we get to have that yet. Check this out. Interesting. Nice. And that's not a safe fire. Get down from there! Bad enough, you're drunk. Why do you have to go climbing houses? <laughs> oh, not supposed to go climbing on other people's roofs, huh? Nope. <laughs> Get down from there! Listen, Still haven't figured out how to shut my head off. That's what you want, isn't it? For me to fall on my head! What I want is for you to climb oh, down! All kinds of culture what going up here. What you want is for me to have no fun at all! Machines and beasts. Fine! All Stay up on the roof all night if you want. Yeah, I will. We lived alongside each other in the comfort of her wild embrace. But some grew restless. Though they took backstory her bounty, here. They wanted more. These were the faithless. The machines had whispered to them, promised to serve them, to make them a new world, better than the one all mother provided. A world of metal. They told the Faithless they would do all the work for them. Feed them, shelter them, give them a life of ease, of plenty. And so, the Faithless left with the machines. Only the true children, the mothers and fathers of the Nora, stayed with all mother. At first, the machines did as they had promised. They built cities, 
great and terrible, monuments to their sins, but they would not serve the faithless for long. A king rose up among the machines, a machine more powerful than any other, the Metal Devil. And then the faithless served him, the metal served devil. the machines. That was not enough for the Metal Devil. He wanted all to serve him and tried to tempt the true children away from All Mother. They would not go. They gathered on the mountainside to cling to her and prayed, more devoted than ever. The Metal Devil raged louder than thunder. In his fury, he came to confront All Mother, intending to kill her. She struck him down forever. As you know, for his lifeless body is up there still frozen in shame and defeat. The machines were driven mad by the death of their king, and their minds became as wild as beasts. The faithless abandoned their cities, forced to wander the world without the care of the machines. Only we remain the true children of All Mother. We built all this with the hands that she gave us. Machines are to be hunted. Metal to be used for scrap, for craft, but never to be adored. And we stay true to her laws, resolute in our prayers, don't we? For the dangers are never over. Still the faithless envy our sacred land and covet it. And year upon year, the machine's anger grows, searching for little more boys and girls who have not behaved. <gasps> what? Is that a machine among us now? <laughs> no, no. These old eyes are mistaken. They didn't get scared. Listen carefully now, for you'll have to tell this when I'm gone. In the beginning, okay. interesting. All life came from all mother. So yeah, a little allegory of what happened. I wonder what that um, all were her children. The metal devil was. We've seen it up there. It looks like big tentacled beast. Oh look, some goodies. Though they took of her bounty, they All right, let's take it. These were the Sweet. And do we need um make more of this? To make them a new world. Okay, we've got all of those. So now if we sold anything for the shards for that uh, armor, we'd be good. Um Oh, look, I got that little plate on my arm. I wonder if that's how I avoid ranged attacks for, like, Wonder Woman. My bracelets. Let's see. In my inventory, resources, we're down to three of the sparkers. Okay. Only the true children, the mothers and father. Aloy, over here. Oh, it's the merchant dude. Karst? What are you doing here? Careful. Pretend like we've never met. I wasn't supposed to trade with outcasts in the wilds, remember? How could I forget? That's why you said, hey, how over here. You to talk to me now? Don't be like that. You know I'll be rooting for you in the proving tomorrow. Can't wait to see the looks in some of these faces when you win. And if you need any last minute supplies, uh, I'm your man. Okay, let's trade. I'll give you my best prices, I promise. So, uh, maybe let's actually buy these sparkers. I don't know if it's a buy multiple. It's only five metal shards. Okay, so we have eight sparkers. That's enough to buy the thing if we want. It didn't cost a whole lot. Does he have... Oh, he's got this stuff too. Yeah, the protector. It's only against melee attacks. But that could be useful. But that doesn't give any kind of actual protection. Yeah, let's buy it. Let's buy it. What the heck? Yeah, let's equip it. 
tweet and we can put a modifier in it too. We should have saved that other modifier. Uh, this guy... I don't know that he sells modifiers. Let's get a few more of these. Just so we have enough. If we need to um, make another pack for that thing. Okay. Thank you, dude. I think See we sold Christmas. everything already. Good luck. All right. And we got the Nora Protector light. Let's craft. So let's modify it. So this is what we have left. Resist freeze, resist shock, and stealth. Uh, let's, I guess, resist shock. It's only 5%. Let's do that. Okay. So she's a little bit armored now. Hopefully that'll work out. In a moment, we shall bless the proving. But first, we have guests to welcome. You digging them, Jay? For two years, we have been at peace with Akarja. It is time to restore our bonds of trade with Meridian. These envoys come to us under a banner of peace. Peace. It's peace. <clears throat> An annunciation of gratitude Written Killers by and the slavers! Hand of yeah! Sun King yeah. Of Killers and slavers! Hey, hey! Luminous! Hold your fruit, Nora. Uh, Nora faithful. Hold your fruit. Now I'm Azure. Hold your fruit. Not Karja. So I'll put it to you straight. The 13th Sun King was a murderous bung. Oh, he was. He was a tyrant and a monster. He raided my tribe for blood sacrifice, just like yours. My own sister was taken. I hated the Karja. But the 13th King is dead. Two years now. now who killed him? The 14th. Yeah. Not because he, he lusted for power, but because someone had to put an end to his father's atrocities. Yeah. Oh, patricide. The message that this poor priest means to read is an apology. Straight from the lips of the 14th king. So please, can't you lend him your ears? I need my ears. Oh, yeah, thank you. <clears throat> An enunciation of gratitude written by the hand of Sun King Avad, 14th luminance of the Radiant Line. <clears throat> Dude's got one too. On the eve of your proving, no, the Karja stand with you as the sun's light. Okay. Scan with my focus. As those you have nurtured take their places among your Talk to the man. We join your prayers. He's wearing a focus, just like mine. I am grateful for your audience. You're the only other person I've ever seen wearing a focus. Where did you get yours? What? A Nora? Wearing one of these? That's impossible. Your tribe fears the old places. Forbids them. Who says I'm like other Nora? Why, uh, I guess you're not. If you've gone delving in the ruins of the metal world. What's wrong? Apologies. Ah. Uh, a malfunction. Oh, Lynn, you making friends with locals, are we? I'll... I'll come back. Wait. No, uh, we'll talk later. Have to go. Well, I was gonna have to fix it. Well, I guess he's more hungover than I thought. <laughs> hey, you got the same trinket that Olin has on his head. Since when did those become fashionable? His name is Olin? Who is he? And where did he get one of these? Ah, he's just a scrounger with friends in high places. Now he spends half his time digging for artifacts, the other half drinking or dicing. As for the trinket, well, I guess he dug it up somewhere. Just a weird old jewel he sticks on his face. I mean, no offense, it looks great on you. <laughs> it's all about looks. 
<laughs> what else do you know about Olin? Is he really that interesting? I'm starting to get jealous. Well, he scours the wilds for ruins, digs up as stuff, as and sells back. it to yeah. nobles. <laughs> when he's not scrounging, he's scouting. Exactly the skills you want the man guiding your expedition to have. I've known him for a few years. He's a loyal companion, cares for his family, holds his drink well enough. I like him, but besides that, not much to tell. Nice armor. I've never seen armor like yours before. You've never seen Vanguard steel? Vanguard oh, steel. I guess that's what we're after. Ring locked, impact protected, sturdy enough to choke a sawtooth. It has to be. The Vanguard of the Sun King's best. Life takers and machine breakers to a one. We might even give a Nora war maid like you more trouble than she can handle. <laughs> With all that metal to slow you down? I doubt it. Yeah, hard to say. <laughs> From where I'm standing, looks like a pretty even match. Is that his way of flirting? <laughs> I thought your friend was going to go down in a hail of fruit, but you really calmed the crowd. Uh, thanks. I, I wasn't sure I could do it. The Nora is still pissed with the Karja about the Red Raids. And who can blame them? Okay. I should make my way to the Blessing. Yeah. Look, maybe I shouldn't say this, but it's obvious that you don't belong in this backwater. I mean, you're smart. You're obviously capable. And, well, I mean, look at you. Uh, what are you talking about? You know what? All right, if you ever visit Meridian, look me up. I'll show you around, make introductions. It'll be a whole new life if you want look it. Look at you. I'll even introduce uh -huh. you to my sister. She's got more connections than I do. I thought you said she was captured and killed by the last Sun King. Ha! <laughs> captured, yes. Killed, no. That takes more than a few cards to finish Ursa. She got away. Now she's captain of the entire Vanguard. All right. That's quite a story. Maybe I'll tell it to you sometime over a drink. Anyway, I have to go to that blessing thing, too. So, uh, see you around, maybe? Hmm, maybe. I don't think you're my type. You got a nice hammer, though. Alright, we gotta go to the blessing ceremony. 